It's a fizzy pleasure sold in restaurants, stores, vending machines. And with slogans like pure as sunlight, have a coke and a smile, or more recently, open happiness, it isn't exactly known for its healthy image. But now, with the National Institute of Health reporting two-thirds of American adults are overweight or obese, the world's largest beverage company is calling this problem, quote, the issue of this generation and getting involved. For the first time, Coca-Cola is launching a series of ads focusing on its past of providing drinks with fewer or zero calories and more diet options. But many health professionals say, despite its fewer calories, it's still soda. What happens when your insulin spikes is then it's going to drop and then your body's going to be hungry. So people that drink Coke, regular or diet, um, eat more than they normally would. Coca-Cola says it's simply addressing the obesity issue, not reacting to any public opinions, even though some of those public opinions are loud and clear. Well, I think pop is bad. There's nothing good about it. It's a guilty pleasure and I do drink pop once in a while. There's nothing really good in it. There's no juice in it. There's no vitamins in it. Um, it really doesn't hydrate you like water can. Coca-Cola has made attempts to combat opinions like these by placing the number of calories on the side of each can. A personal trainer, Ryan Heary, says that's not enough, especially when it comes to kids. Kids from the age 9 to 12 drink uh, 3 to 4 um, so does a day, on, a, on average, basically. So that, that amounts to about um, 15 teaspoons of sugar a day. It's going to affect them. They could be obese, they could have diabetes, they could have bad teeth. Despite new efforts to sell water and juices, Coca-Cola reports diet sodas account for nearly a third of its U.S. sales. So are these ads misleading? They're misleading for a reason because they do want to try to target the people that are on a quote-unquote diet. Just because it's diet doesn't mean it's for a diet. In Traverse City, I'm Erica Erickson, 7 and 4 News.